welcome to this new week with Joe. <laughs> we got a pack from eBay, but uh, I don't know what's happened with this. I think um, let's have a watch what's inside. And ah, well packed, I see. I know, never see a, a stripe from eBay itself. So, and let's open it. What they would like to send me this time? <laughs> it's inside. Hey, come on. This is. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's interesting. So, little thing. Little thing. Here we are. Can that be? Ha ha ha! This is interest. Can that be? Is it a radio or an amplifier or stuff like this? I don't know. What's happened? Hey! Hello, hello, hello! Oh, it's a fine art CD player and it's defect. Look, it's defect. Definitive defect. <laughs> cool. I am wondering DHL pack 2199. Poor, expensive. We're gonna make a test uh, in case of that we. Put in a CD and what's happened? Oh, it's running. That means, uh -huh, break. That means it needs a new belt. Sweetened effect on it. I mean, I don't know why. Maybe it needs a clean and stuff like this. We checked. Here it is. This is fine arts. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. In case of our model, we would like to open up the, the, the drive tray. And here we are. Uh -huh. It's easy. Disconnected from the power. And then we must uh, lift up this. It's a very complicated procedure to uh, we have two I hope so you can see this we have here two schnappies and these schnappies will lift this away so I can <laughs> put it away and uh, over so it's the first point what we must do then we go in tuck it went in and then we must deinstall the deinstall the drive from this body it's very interesting if you uh, a metal part disconnected from the power this is important that this because here is dangerous here we have our schnappy you see, it's cheap, cheaper, cheap cannot be. And here we have the same. We have nothing to disconnect, I think. Uh, maybe it's on the ground. Uh, there is only stands. Uh, I must have a watch how I can open this thing. I change it to the back side and would like to deinstall these parts the change connector and you see because these are in the way to build out also the digital out the RC bus remote control bus uh, you can uh, control your CD player over this remote control bus if the CD player will be in a in a furniture built in and uh, it is closed so the infrared cannot command cannot come there you have the infrared receiver outside you can control it over this so we open up this 
and we change it back and I hope so everything went wrong <laughs> no <laughs> I don't hope so everything went wrong but this is very uh, I mean so cheap build you cannot believe this is uh, ridiculous for a company like Grundig it's uh, it's a no-go <laughs> you must also lift this with the so I lift this and I lift that on this side on the right side can you see that I hold this with the oh what's called like with this green one thing uh, I don't understand how that work maybe there's a screw inside or stuff like this could be could be or not Ah, it's maybe a uh, other dim dimension. I must search. I found out that the uh, other thing must be unscrew here. This is with a smaller one. Oh, look. With this. It's a T9. Hmm. Smaller one and T9. I think so. It's also here. I cannot see that. I did, ah, it is here. Yeah, it is here. Look, it's here on these three feet. And here. The two. Okay. <laughs> help! I need somebody help! <laughs> ah, is that is that unclear how we can open it? Ah, says, ah, I must also cut here the the power lines. No, I don't cut the power lines, but there is a, a zip tie, and this is in the way. Second zip tie. And what's next? Uh, I don't know. I cannot disconnect this connector because this is uh, it's unbelievable how they can build a machine like this. Okay, we do that. I make a mark on it. That means one. And here also, that means one. So now I can disconnect it because these are uh, from Grundig from the 80s. It's a schnappy. It's a, a press in and fit. Look how cheap this is. <laughs> you must press in. You press in, look, you press in and pull it out. We got now the right screwdriver and this is a cross. <laughs> Very funny across because uh, it's strong. Hey, come on, how strong is this? I'm very sorry for that, but I need a, a driller. Ah, oh, it's long, strong and long because ah, oh, it's dangerous. It's so dangerous. I must pull that out. This tip tie, tip tie. What's on the other side? What went wrong? Ah, it's a flex PCB. I see you. You can see that. It's flex PCB. It's here. Oh, it's a special schnappy. It's not in this. Oh, it could be in this direction. Oh, it's a it's a other way schnappy. It's this. Okay. And here. Disconnected here. Look. You can move this. This is super. Huh? <laughs> you close it. <laughs> what do we have here? Um, oh, a board. You can see here is the power supply. Came here in. Here are the diodes for the AC to DC conversion. Maybe this and this is the the power supply. And here you have a regulator. I see 12. Mm -hmm. And also this, maybe this T. Yeah, looks like nice. Maybe it's switch on and off also. 
One is uh, for permanent power and the other is for switched power. Look, but this is, I mean, could not be, should not be. Now we came to this part here and what we happened, laser division. <laughs> hey, look, ooh, 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 ooh. it's wobbling. Oops, what's that? Where did this come from? Ah, here. I must remember because it comes down here or here or here. It's not so funny. They're doing stands here. Look. Ah, I mean, how could that be? Plastic stands. And I think this is the transportation motor for the. Ah, look. This is. It's going out here. Aha. Uh -huh. This is the thing, how it works. Mm -hmm. We must pull that out, I think. We must pull that out. How we can pull that out? Look, here it is. Here is the motor that spins up. Mm -hmm. Oh, it stops here. Ah, look, here is a schnappy. Here is a central schnappy that we put out. Then we can. Put it out. Look, <laughs> it's very easy. You must don't don't be angry if this don't work. Um, I'm doing this since uh, 35 years to repairing things. Oh, look, look, <laughs> it's also here. <laughs> Small schnappy. Look, <laughs> this plasticy thing. Mm -hmm. uh, and now we have here the the gun. Uh, I have found out um, a 50, but this is too big. Think it, it's a it's a 48, but I get a 45 because this is much thicker, and I have more grip. More grip is better than lower grip or less grip. <laughs> yeah, it's it's hard. It's hard, <laughs> but if I get a 50. It's also hard because it's too thin. The, they sent me thin, not correct. I mean, this is not one millimeter. Look at this. Oh, so no, it's not bad. It's not bad, but it's very thin. Look, it's much thinner than the other. Yeah, you cannot see it because the camera cannot make the resolution. But uh, uh, here, maybe you can see it. Yeah, it could be. Um, I think I got uh, the 50, but uh, first we must uh, clean it up and then we have a watch. I take the 50 and isopropyl, what else? <laughs> Um, I'm doing the clean now uh, for the wheels and hope so this is working. Look, sponge, sponge stick. I clean it and I clean this here. Okay, super. That's correct. That's a correct thing. Close the bottle and then we install the number 50 because the grip is not so not so good from this but uh, I think the tray and I hope so clack look <gasps> I forgot something I forgot this plastic is thing here in the middle I mean it's not important to have this but okay well I press it in I hope so it fits now uh, so it's not my my thing not a good not a good idea I must take it out again because this 
and snap in this look it's much better now put the schnappi in the tray will go in so and we must install that now um, I hope so I hope so I do not change the, the rings here and it's the same situation as before. So we must uh, turn this around and insert the stands. I remember it, it was so and so and um, on this side I think. Uh, could be. Now we must uh, flip this over and connect here. Ah. Oh my gosh, this is, I mean, what for fingers they have, special fingers, they can grip around or stuff like this, no, cannot be. I put it here on the side and would like to insert this flex PCB here. In front of the camera it's not so funny to do that because there is someone is watching behind me and ah, so Tuck. it's not worst it's not the worstest thing so I go back to this situation uh, bring that out these cable things out oh the, the audio is gone and now uh, after this bring the cable out bring the cable out so it's better the cable outside than inside. So, stands are standing. And I must insert the screws back. My camera is going out. So, and so on. <laughs> I should build this in and what I should make is um, I should make um, I should fix this first um, here with these long screws and the little ones And here we have so oh I think interest why it is so complicated hmm or should I are these the long screws or the short screws this is a oh <laughs> these are the from the back side these screws here should be short screws inside little short screws ah what the hell is going on here <laughs> <laughs> Zack. I must fix it here and here and then I must fix it with the screws but with a small one here are the small ones yes these are the small ones I should paint it with the small ones yes correct this is correct now I found out this is not so easy to do, but zack. But they have short ones, but the long ones are on the back side. Fix it. Super. Now I would like to bring in these wires here. Oh. It's not so easy to to do this. Press here and bring it in. 
look press here you must press it and bring it in take this screwdriver you must press this and bring it in and fiddle it in but zack okay it's not so it's not so complicated but I think it's it's not a good construction. I mean, huh? What shall I tell you? It's a. I must take this. Must have a. Okay, that works. You see it? That works. If I have this uh, this wire here, the red one, orange, red, aha. Uh -huh. Orange is on this side, orange is on this side. We need to press it in and push this in. We must press it in. I must press this in and push this in. RD means red, I think. Push this in. So this, push this in. Super. That works. Next step is um, I must go in with this and uh, fix the fix the back side I will um, do this with the long screw so you can see this install that step by step and count the screws all screws must be back in the same position as where you get them from or where you build or disassemble it um, this is important because some of these screws maybe have a grounding or a grounding function for these connectors also to the body this is a metal body it's not steel, but it's um, it's a inexpensive look. It's an inexpensive metal material. So super, looks very good. I like this machine. It's built so simple, but uh, the connectors I'm not so happy. But okay, that. So now we must have a clean here inside this. <laughs> it looks not so good. Fold the paper and Kleenex. It's not Kleenex, it's clean air. Look, clean air. <laughs> David Murray, the 8 bit guy, using Kleenex. A thousand times, maybe also the Kleenex company say thank you to him. <laughs> I don't know. I must ask him <laughs> what's happening with the Kleenex company. And I also clean this. That should be colorized or polarized or so. I don't know for what they built in that. Maybe it looks like better and sharper and you cannot see the, the things inside. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is so. We must stick up this and also we clean that. This is always a good idea. We clean that with the same. Look, you can see here the numbers and all the things, what's inside. This is interesting display. It looks like a fluorescence display, but it is not so a fluorescence display. Ah, look now. It's beautiful again. That's for that don't fall down. 
I hope so it was not done. So we must connect this front board and we have a click in or should we do that? Should we click in? Yeah, we have the, the maximum and we click in. It's on the schnappy. Schnappy, click and click. Look, it's clicked in. It looks not good. Or is, it, is that good? It's good and correct. I don't know. If it's good and correct, then it's okay for me, but it's not good and correct. Schnappy here. Ah, look, this was the point. Must press a little bit because I think so. This came not out. Hmm. Interest. This is in built in. Maybe it's the same high. It's the same high. Look, it's really precision built. It's exact built. So we must bring in these connectors. Uh, I cannot show you this or I can show you this. Maybe from this side. Look. From this. We push it. And we bring in the three the three connectors. Yes. That's finish. Also we connect this grounding here. And look at the stands. These stands are built in on both sides for holding up the white on the next. If you stack this machine over and over, uh, have the white. This is your press and here also. <laughs> we must um, insert this. This is much easier. No, it's not much easier. It's much complicated. We must press this in here. Oh my gosh. And press it in. Okay, that works. Let's have a watch on the functionality of the of the tray. On. He checked. Aha. What's happened now with this? I think it's a mechanical disaster. It's, I cannot hold. Okay, let's have a look. If we push this out, we make a, make a difference between the mechanical problem and this. Uh, it's here. This can work. Yeah, but this is the, the the thing is that it is not the it is not the I think so it's not the oh, what shall I say? It's not the hmm, what what can I do? I put this spool under here and the other spool under the table. Oh, that's my, I put the machine under these spools, so I'm over the um, Not the power. 
This motor don't have the power. <gasps> I see something. This is the plasticky thing what's inside. Okay, come out, come out, come, come, come. It's not the power from the motor, it's the plasticky thing what's. So, we must now. Um, <laughs> we must now. Um, putting this schnappy. Put this away, okay. And now this. This motor spin spins around. Put it here. Look at this. This spins. Haha. -ha. This is interesting. What we gonna do here now? We can only say we must put a clue on it. Well. We put a clue on it. In the screen to see is the switch on. I put it out. Look at the astrograph at the lila. Up now. It's from the processor. Yellow in. Yellow in. Lila out. Yellow in. But this. Is the control from the from the microcontroller? Why? Uh, why this signal came out? I don't understand this. Okay, yellow is in. Uh huh. And that means the controller destroys the machine in case of they give out um, this uh, corner signal and well, what shall I do? This came from the processor, this problem. One other story. If you have a watch on the on the osteograph, you see the lila out. Now it comes. Press in. Yellow drives in with a normal signal. Could that be the first dead counter on machines? There is no mechanical interruption in the way. Look, it's working perfect. How we can fix this problem? <laughs> I have an idea. <laughs>